welcome to my classroom today i am going to teach you comparing numbers with the help of signs greater than lesser than equal to we will begin with the story the crocodile and the fishes once upon a time there lived a crocodile in a big river the crocodile was very fond of eating fishes but he never used to eat small fish but always liked big fishes hence his mouth always opened towards the big fish he was quite happy eating the big fishes he lived happily in the river so this is all about the story my dear children now as we know the story of the crocodile and the fishes it will be easier for us to compare the numbers and put the signs accordingly now i will tell you how to do that now let me take two numbers when we compare numbers we compare one number with another one for example let me take Nine and another number three. Now see, children, we have two numbers here. One is nine, another number is three. Now we have to compare. What is compare? We have to identify which number is big and which number is small. Now this nine and three. Can you tell me? which number is the big number yes 9 9 is the big number and 3 is the small number now when we have these two numbers and we are asked to put the sign how shall we do that here comes the story of the crocodile that i have told you a little before now you think these numbers to be the fishes this is a big fish because this is the big number think that this is the big fish and this is a small number means this is the small fish now as i told you the crocodile always used to open its mouth towards the big fish right now if you are asked to put the sign how will you put it now the crocodile always used to open its mouth towards the big fish so let us make the crocodile's mouth Now see children this is the crocodile's mouth this crocodile's mouth it is open towards the big number that means what 9 is greater than 3 the number 9 is greater than number 3 okay let me take another example suppose we take take a number Twenty-five. Here we take a number fifty-two. Now we will compare these two numbers: twenty-five on one side and fifty-two on the other side. Now tell me, which number is bigger, twenty-five or fifty-two? Fifty-two is bigger. Very good. Fifty-two is bigger than twenty-five. So now, think this number fifty-two as a big fish, and this number twenty-five as the small fish. Why twenty-five as the small fish? Because twenty-five is the small number, and why fifty-two is the big fish? Because fifty-two is the big number. Now, the crocodile's mouth. which side will it open its mouth obviously towards the big fish because the crocodile is really very fond of big fish so let us make the 
crocodile's mouth. Yes, here is it. This is the crocodile's mouth. Remember the crocodile's mouth will always open towards the big fish that is towards the big number. Now how do we read this? After we finish writing we have to read it out for comparison. How should we do that? We will say number 25 is less than number 52. Here we said that number 9 is bigger than number 3. Number 25 is lesser than number 52. I will give you one more example so that it becomes clear to you. I write a number. Suppose I write here 70. And on the other side I write 17. One side 70, another side I write 17. Now children, which number is bigger? 70 is bigger or 17 is bigger? Number 70 is bigger. So this is, imagine this number 70 as the big fish and number 17 as the small fish. And then we are going to make the crocodile's mouth open. So which side will it open? It will open towards the big fish. That is number 70 is bigger than number 17. I hope this much is very much clear to you. Greater than and lesser than. Now let us come to the sign equal to. Now where to put equal to sign? I will tell you now. When we get two same numbers, we put equal to sign. When both the numbers are same. For example, I write here. On my right, on my left hand side, I write 11. And on my right hand side also, I write 11. Now look at these two numbers very carefully. On my left side, I have written 11. And on my right side, I have also written 11. Now, when you look at these two numbers, you see these two numbers are same. 11, like left side also 11, right side also 11. Now, these two numbers are same. So, when we get two numbers of the same value, we do not write greater than or lesser than. We write this sign. Two sleeping lines. This is the sign of equal to. Equal to means same. 11 is equal to 11. So we write here equal to sign. So my dear children, this is all about comparison of numbers. I hope you have understood, understood it well. In my next video, I will come up with one more interesting topic. Till then, goodbye.